Good evening, YouTubers. You might uh, recall on the uh, Sabian uh, Distro Review for GNOME Edition that I had a drama with um, Steam. Now, uh, I've replicated that drama. I've worked out how to fix it again. I had forgotten, well, not entirely forgotten. The logic was there, just the exact details were not. But anyway, as you can see, when I go and click on Steam, nothing happens. So, on further investigation, and I recommend this, if you've got a GUI pro program that just fails to run, try and run it from the command line. So we'll run it. You'll see that it complains about the Radian SI driver. Now, I recalled some time ago that this had something to do with uh, libc. And uh, I'm not entirely wrong on that, but uh, my memory failed me in one little detail. I'll show you why. i ring up here. Okay can see that uh, this guy here, if you go in, I just search for Steam Radian SI and you can see here Steam, this is the first link that came up with. I'm going to ignore this for now because I didn't find it was relevant in my situation, but you see this guy here? Well, if you look at this, the, well, first of all, I suppose I should show you this, is that uh, this is a C, C++ standard library and GNU C or libc, glibc apparently now supports C++ and other programming languages so yeah um, this is the implementation of the C standard library this is the implementation or this is the C++ standard library so there was therein lies the confusion now, I remember the little detail here and I think it's because Radeon SI um, relies on libc as all Linux applications, to the best of my knowledge all Linux applications will ultimately rely on libc and it turns out that uh, Steam has its own libc standard C++ which then being being as it that Radeon SI is not compiled against that particular one um, it doesn't work and Lord knows why they include it. I presume it's because of Ubuntu compatibility or something like that. So, I'm going to show you now how to fix that problem. What you do is you can search within the Steam directory. So, I'm in the Steam directory at the moment. Find at the present working directory. What this says is find any of the shared objects that start with lib standard C++. Of course, I'm only finding by file name, so you could have a contrived um, file with this .so, but I trust the system and I'll find it. So you can see here, you can find it just there. So what I do now is I exec against it. You can look up the find uh, man page to understand what I'm doing, but this basically says whatever you find, do the following to the, this the exec bit rm v oh, sorry, this rm v and then delete, delete whatever you find that matches ok and then you can just do that, you can see it removed it and now let's run steam it now runs, as you can see. So I can just close that now and do it from the menu. Now you can see it works flawlessly. So we'll log into an existing account. Okay, and then we log in. and everything is working nicely. I've got my games that I've purchased a license for on here and yeah I could go ahead and install any of these and uh, start playing. So that's it guys, that's how you solve that problem. Sorry that I uh, wasn't able to give an explanation exactly and I fumbled around finding, trying to find libc. I was on the right track. 
but uh, ultimately in the end I uh, didn't have it so anyway please uh, like and subscribe and comment as usual have a good night good day or whatever you're having and I look forward to seeing you in the next video